welcome back to Oh My Nosh. Today we are making mince pie twists. This is a super easy festive recipe to get everyone involved really and it's just a bit of a different take on your normal mince pie and I think it will even convince people that don't normally like mince pies to like mince pies. I've got some pre-made puff pastry and some pre-made mince meat. There's no faffing around here. Making your own puff pastry is not easy and we want this to be as simple as possible. So 500 grams of puff pastry and a jar of mince meat. We've got a floured work surface and we're going to just pop the pastry on here. Just roll it in the, pastry, the flour a little bit just to stop it from sticking. Grab a rolling pin, make sure it's floured, and then we're just going to roll it out to kind of the size of our baking sheet. We want it to try and be as even as possible. Then, on a lined baking tray, we've got that prepped. Make sure it's not stuck. So, with a tablespoon, there we go. Gonna grab our mince meat and we're just going to layer it over. Make sure you get as much of the like saucy stuff to the edges. And then with a knife, we're going to kind of cut it into one centimeter ish strips. About two centimeters. And then as it goes onto the tray, we're just going to twist and twist and twist. And some of the filling might fall out, that's fine. Okay. Stick it down. And then repeat. Twist. And you want the twist to look as similar as possible so that everything is neat and tidy. And make sure to spread the twists out. It's quite messy and sticky. Just grabbed another tray for the next bit. Um, a really good tip is to scrunch, if you can hear me over this, scrunch your baking paper. And that means that it stays in place. And then what I'm going to do is crack an egg for the egg wash. Little man. Just go paint that on. Be generous because it makes it go all golden. And just do it on the bits where the pastry obviously hasn't got mince meat and is going to go golden brown. And then we're going to pop these in the oven for 15 to 20 minutes until they're really golden brown. We've got the mince pie twists out of the oven and we're just going to top them with a sprinkling of icing sugar and then they're ready to eat. And there we have it, mince pie twists. A modern twist, see what I did there, on a classic. 